China North Industries is the largest manufacturer of land weapon systems in China. And they manufacture everything from main battle tanks, tracks, light armoured vehicles, wheel combat vehicles, and this very unusual VN-18 tracked amphibious assault vehicle. This has been developed to, to meet the requirements of the Marine Corps and is unique in that it has got fairly high road speed as well as a unique amphibious capability. When deployed in the water, it is propelled by two water jets and if you look at the front, a trim main is extended at the front and also another element at the rear. And when it's in the water, it's propelled by two water jets. This particular version is armed with a 30mm cannon and a 7.62mm machine gun. And if you notice, mounted on either side is an anti-tank guided weapon. There is another version which is not being shown here this year, and that is the direct fire support vehicle. That is similar hold to this, but is fitted with a, a turret armed with a 105mm gun can, that can fire a wide range of ammunition type, as well as a, a 105 laser guided projectile out to a range of about 5 kilometres. That amphibious assault vehicle direct fire support will be used to provide covering fire as the Marines go into the beach and also as they go inland. Um, the nearest vehicle to this in the world is the American AAV-7A1, but that is significantly slower and has less firepower. The US were developing an expeditionary fighting vehicle, but that was cancelled after the expenditure of two or three billion dollars because it wasn't reliable. But China has developed a vehicle with better capabilities than the AAV-7A1 and capabilities approaching that of the US vehicle. For many years this was not offered on the export market but it is now being marketed as a number of countries in the area do have marine forces such as for example Thailand, um, South Korea and other countries who would potentially have a requirement for this unique vehicle which has no equal anywhere else in the world today.